I'm out here in the Holy Cross wilderness in Colorado. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> in Colorado. And uh, I'm about to summit my first 14er, baby. Uh, there's the summit right there. And uh, it's definitely been a slog, but it hasn't been too hard. Uh, it's obviously a phenomenal view. And I'm really close to the top. I can feel the glory. Started on the trail at about seven. And it's, uh, oh, it doesn't show my phone what time it is. I don't know what time, <coughs> I don't know what time it is. It's probably 10.30 or so. So made pretty good time, but you gotta start early and get to the peak early on the 14ers in the summer because thunderstorms come in in the afternoon. You don't wanna be on a peak during a thunderstorm. <coughs> it's a recipe for disaster. Oh my God. I went over a pass in Peru called Dead Woman Pass that was over 14,000 feet but I've never done a peak that's 14,000. And also in Peru, <coughs> because it's closer to the equator, the oxygen is thicker. The atmosphere is thicker there, there's more oxygen. So <coughs> <coughs> it's actually a little easier to breathe down there than here. So this is definitely, the less, uh, least amount of oxygen I've ever had, but I only have a day pack, so it's pretty easy compared to, I mean, back backpacking a 12,500 foot pass, in my opinion, is harder than day hiking a 14er. With a little light pack. I mean, I literally only have snacks and water and a jacket. But here I am. Making it. Hi. Oh, and look, there's a mountain goat up here. Hey there. Yeah, it's pretty on that side. The views over there. Well, what a nice greeting at the summit, baby. Hi. And we made it. First 14er, let's go baby.